Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my channel if you are new. My name is Noni. We are going to be talking about affordable skincare product that you can use on your face, especially if you're starting out on your skincare journey. These are going to be the basic things you need for you to start your skincare journey and get great results. And they are going to be very, very affordable. So, because I just started my skincare, if you're starting your skincare and you want it to be very affordable, you don't want to go big on it because it's something that you're still learning about and that you need to like get used to some things before you can be able to buy more things if you have too much money. But if you are not, if you're on a budget like me and you need something very affordable to start your skincare, this video is for you. Yeah, the first thing you'll be needing if you're starting your skincare is a bag, a toilet bag. You need a kind of toilet bag where you can put all your skincare products so that it can help you stay organized. You need a toilet bag where you can put your creams and all that things that you'll be, I'll be mentioning in this video. So toilet bag is the first thing you will need when you're starting your skincare. The next thing you'll be needing is a towel. You need a towel. You need a towel, one for your face and, and body towel. You can't even be using your body towel on your face. So you need a small towel for your face that you can use to like clean your face when you finish uh, washing your face. So towel is very important. Next thing you'll be needing is an exfoliant. You need an exfoliant. Exfoliant can be chemical exfoliant. It can be body scrub scrubs like this is my coffee and the uh, coffee and coffee and brown sugar scrub i use it to scrub my face at least twice in a week i use this i've i think i've made a video about this recipe the only thing different from this one is i added coconut oil to this one but the one i made a video of i did not add coconut oil. so there's coconut oil here coffee brown sugar a dash of lemon and the uh, tea tree oil but if i what i usually do is i just mix all the dry ingredients and the oils in in here then when i want to use it if i feel like add, adding lemon i'll add but if i don't feel like adding lemon i can use i can just take out small and add a uh, fresh tomato juice in it and turn it and use it to scrub my face it does wonders guys because this face as of few months ago or few, as of weeks ago or months ago that I had my baby, I don't think, if you guys can tell, you can tell there's a very big difference in my face now, it's looking a little brighter, and we are still on the journey, or then, you also need a body scrub, like body scrub, like this, this is my DIY body scrub that I made, this is my, oops, so this is my DIY body, body scrub that, that I made. And you know, we are talking about it being affordable. And if, you're, if you really want it to be very affordable for you, you will need to be good in making DIYs products. So this is the one I made in my house. In here, I have white sugar. I have dato. I have my shower gel. I have a coconut oil. And I also have tea tree oil in this one. So I also use this twice a week like weekends and the uh, midweek that's when i use this to scrub my body but if i'm too busy after the weekend and i don't have time to like reuse this within the week i use my exfoliating bad glove i use this bad glove this is also exfoliating or i use this sponge this sponge is also very exfoliating i don't know if you're in nigeria i'm sure you must have seen this sponge in the market is very exfoliating like I use this every day to bait like if I want to bait this is the sponge I use every day so if you have something like this and something like this you don't really need the body scrub always you can just do it once in a week or uh, if you don't want to use the body scrub this also can do the job because it is very very exfoliating while you're using it then if you don't want to use, go through all this process you can also get chemical exfoliant. Chemical, what I mean by chemical exfoliant is there some facial cleanser that has salicylic acid. So any facial cleanser that has salicylic acid is a chemical exfoliant. I'll be leaving some pictures of some that I've used in the past here, like uh, clean and clear, clean and clear products. They are good. Neutrogena products. They are good. Or 
if you don't want to use i can also buy glycerin and rose water to use it to like clean your face and tone the face at once so you need a, you need an exfoliant in your skincare you cannot be complete without an exfoliant because all those dead cells if you don't exfoliate before applying every other product you're using it is going to be a waste of resources so you need an exfoliant well be it chemical physical bath glove uh, scrub any part of the sky. I will be leaving some pictures of some that I have used also. The next thing you'll be needing is a soap. You need a soap, a face soap. This one, I someone recommended this soap for me, like a cottage, it's called Cottage Fresh. Someone recommended it for me. I've been using it for, for weeks now and it's very, very uh, good on my skin. But the only thing that it does to my face, when I use it, like when I apply it and leave it, I don't wash it out immediately. It, it makes my face feel a little bit dry, but it is it cleans once you wash your face with it It cleanses your face very so you need a face soap. This is one I'm using. This is called cottage fresh and uh, I also have this one Asan, Ashanti Abi Asanti Asanti face soap. This is what I use But the problem is that this one I heard that they have imitation in the market So I don't know make sure you're getting the original one. but this one does not have much imitation then you can, if you cannot, if you can't get, this one is cost the 1,000. This one is cost 1,500 naira. I, that's, this one I got is 1,500 naira in Abuja here. And this one, I think I got this one for 750, 750 naira. And it is going to last because you're using this just for your face. This is, I use this on my body and on my face. But if you're using this for your face, I'm, I'm sure this can last you, can last you months if you're using it just for your face. And it is very, very good. So you... You also need a face wash if you don't want to use the this uh, that the one I showed before and this uh, Asante you can get a face wash that you can use to wash your face especially those days when you come back from work and you're very tired this one is very very okay to help your face to reset this is from simple simple product I will be inserting their prices that I bought them uh, on the screen for you guys the prices of each of the products that i've used and how, where i got it if you want but i'll be inserting their prices on the screen so this is simple products this is simple simple refreshing fish facial wash and it's soap free it's also odorless so that's why i got it and it's it does the work it does the work for me like i don't have to deal with all those reactions after using all this product so this facial wash is okay for me so you need a facial wash that you can use i will insert insert their prices each of the product i've mentioned there i will be inserting their prices on the screen for you to you see need a face cream you need a face cream if you're starting out on a skincare journey there are so many face cream in the market that are very affordable nivea is affordable 1550 the last time i checked there are so many affordable face cream there's this one that's trending for them whether they say it's stay young but the only thing is that the container is small i've not used it before it stay stay young i also recommended goji, goji berry for me i love the goji berry because my uh, i i tend to react to things that have fragrance especially when it comes to cream so this goji berry is it does not have fragrance. It smells like a pears. If you have used pears baby lotion, you will know the what I mean by it smells like pears. So this is what I use. This is what I use on my face. This is what, another thing you'll be needing is you need a face mask to mask your face at least once in a month. I also do my two. I usually do my turmeric is the most and easiest DIY for me to make and it's already available in my kitchen so I don't really need to like stress myself to get extra product I will leave a link to the one I've made on the screen so you can see just a simple thing you get turmeric add your yogurt add your lemon juice if you have oily skin if you don't have oily skin you add the uh, aloe vera juice to it and mix it together and uh, apply the mask on your face I will need a toner to if you don't have time for the DIY facial mask you can buy the already made one there are so many masks in the market face mask in the market that you can apply to your face I will leave some pictures on the screen the ones that are very affordable that I know that are for them another thing you'll be needing is a serum you need a kind of serum to like after all those 
uh, scrubbing, washing, and uh, moisturizing. You need a serum to help to infuse vitamin C into your skin so that your skin can glow and uh, and repair itself so that you won't have to be dealing with aging, uh, aging and saggy skin. Uh, so a serum is very, very important because it will help to tighten your skin. It will help to uh, glow your skin and uh, all that. So the product I'm using is this product this is a uh, dr rachel a friend of mine who is also a, a who is is also a youtuber benita benita ek yes has made a review on these products before they have the cheaper ones but this is also very affordable because i've had a review about it that is why i got it i think i got it for 2000 something naira. there are some other serum i will check if i can get some and they put some of them on the screen for you guys you can choose what you what your bu budget can carry at the moment then the next thing you'll be need you need a, a sunscreen before i don't usually value this sunscreen because i know mostly expensive so since i bought this one i've noticed that whenever i any day i wear sunscreen out and the uh, if i'm exposed to sun very well even when i come back my face does not look like a fried beans if you don't get this sunscreen when you go out on the, on the sun, after all those your expenses on oil or all those your facial, whatever, before you know it, your face will be looking like fried moim, fried akara, that's bean cake. It's going to protect all those things that you have applied. If not, you might not get result. So sunscreen is very, very important on your skincare journey. Because whenever I apply it and I go out, I come back, I, I've left some days without using it and when I come back, I will check my face then when but the days I use it I will also check check my face I was the difference is always very clear because when you come back your face will not be looking stressed out Like someone that has been under the Sun for years. So this sunscreen is very very important the sunscreen that I'm using is by skin doctor It has SPF 80 this is the one I'm using. This is the one I got. But the only thing I don't like about this is that uh, it leaves white cast on the face. And you also need body creams. I use a uh, Avena product. That's what I've been using since 2012, I guess. 12. That's since I've been using this cream, this Avena. And I've not had any problem. But the only problem I have with it now is now very, very expensive. This one now is sold for... 8,000 Naira I've used uh, Nivea products in the past So this is a Nivea Even and Radiant SPF 50 This one has sunscreen So this is sold for 2,500 Naira This cream here is very moisturizing I've used it in the past I've used it in the past That was before I started using this Avino product I've used is very very good. So what I usually do is when I buy my cream like this, I will just add oil to it. I'll add uh, almond oil. This is what I use on my skin. And you need a body cream, and you want it to be very very affordable. Starting out on the skincare doesn't mean you should break the bank. There are other cream that are very very affordable. This Avino is very expensive now, eight thousand. The small one is three thousand five hundred naira. So I would recommend this if you're starting out on a budget but i'll be leaving some pictures of some creams that i know that are very affordable and that are, and i have seen people that use it that is very very okay on their skin the end so, of the video i hope you enjoyed please don't forget to subscribe like the video share it and uh, comment your favorite product among all the things i have mentioned thank you guys so much for watching i really appreciate your support i will see you guys in the next one bye